Jojo and welcome back to Jojo's Juice where every single Wednesday I usually answer questions but I think I'm going to switch that to every single Wednesday I pour juice on my head because I just don't really answer questions that often anymore. So anyways, today I am going to be showing you guys my favorite slime recipe. Now I love making slime, it's actually probably one of my favorite things to do. Recently I went through a phase where I love fluffy slime, but now I'm really into jiggly slime. So I'm going to show you my favorite way to make jiggly slime. Without further ado, let's get started. So the things that you're going to need is a big bowl. By the way, I'm making the biggest batch that I've ever made of it, so I'm super excited about that. I am using six bottles of about eight ounce Elmer's glue, so a lot. You'll need three bottles of Elmer's glue, eight ounces, like half of what you use full of cold water. And lastly, your borax mixture. Now, I know a lot of things have been going on with degree, third degree burns with the borax, um, but if you dissolve it in the hot water first, you have to use hot water so it is dissolved, you will be fine. As long as you are not sticking your hands straight in the borax, letting it sit there for a year and a half, you will be totally good. I mean, I know things happen out of the blue, but like, you know, just, just be safe and just be smart, which is what I am going to be. I also keep a paper towel by me just so I can put my trash on it and it doesn't ruin my counter. Oh, and also, I am not going to be using colors. I just want it to be white. The first thing that I'm going to do is take my smaller bowl and I'm going to mix the borax in it and I'm about to make my borax solution. I'll see you when it's over. I just finished. Um, it's very hot because it's hot water but the borax mixture is in this bowl. Alright, so I set that mixture aside and now I have my bowl and I'm going to be pouring all six of my Elmer's glue in the bowl. Like this. Okay, I just finished with all six glue bottles, so now I'm going to fill each glue bottle up with cold water. No, not each. I'm gonna fill only three of them up with glue, with water. Half of whatever I did with cold water. You get what I'm trying to say. All done. But I forgot to mention that you are going to be needing a uh, spatula or a spoon or just anything to stir it. So this is what it looks like for right now. I gotta mix it all together and it's going to be all mixed together in three, two, one. Wow. Look at that. It's all mixed together. It's all looking pretty and all gluey and whatever. Now I'm going to walk over here and I'm going to grab this thingy and I'm going to start to add my borax and you'll see that when it's done in three, two, one. Well, this is this slime. This is before I've added the stuff to make it jiggly though. So this is just norm. Okay, excuse you. Anyways, this is just the stuff, like how the slime is, before we add the stuff to make it jiggly. So you might be like, what are you going to add to make it jiggly? And I'm about to show you. So all you have to do to make your slime jiggly is make normal slime, like I just did, and then add hot water. So now, the water that I'm going to be adding is super hot. Not quite boiling. Boiling is just like the hottest that my faucet can go to. Um, or my sink, like whatever you guys call it. Um, I'm still over here poking this slime. Uh, yeah, but so, whatever the hottest it can go to, and then just add that until it's your jiggliness that you would like that. But please be careful and don't burn your hands. But I'm just gonna put it into another bowl right here. And this is a big batch of slime. And then you're just gonna add the hot water until it's when you like it. Wow. So I just finished, so my hands are still a little, you know, wet and slimy and stuff. But I literally, just added like a ton of hot water and it got to this jiggly point. Watch this, you ready? I'm gonna pour it, oh it's really heavy. Ugh. I don't know if you saw that or not, but it's very heavy so I can't even lift it. But I don't know if you can see how far and fast it is expanding or even how big it is, like it is huge. This is like the mama of all slimes, I love it. So, while I'm playing with this slime right now, I'm going to talk to you guys. What you would think is for the juice, I'm about to pour this slime over my head. No, that's not even what's close to happening because I don't know how I would get that out of my hair. Especially jiggly slime. Ugh. Anyways, what is happening though is I am, instead of doing a juice, making you a promise. And you know what the promise is? Is that next week on Wednesday, I'm going to be doing the most insane juice that I've ever done. Still don't know what it's going to be, but it's going to be nasty. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Anyways, love you guys.
you guys so much. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out. Also, go subscribe to my blog channel, JJ Sorrel, or just click the link that's in the description that says subscribe to my blog channel. Um, What else? Like, subscribe, comment down below, and I love you guys. This slime girl is out.